Hey everybody, welcome to my October lineup. So I did go ahead and put down the first kit in my off-camera planner because this is for September 25th through October 1st. And I like to get stuff done ahead of time. So um, this is a kit by Liner Designs. I don't remember the name, but I don't know if she still has it in shop. Uh, I bought it last year. And then the foil is from Planahanna. Next, for October 2nd through the 8th, I am using Booze and Vets by Crest Press. So, um, I was just really excited about how bright and fun this kit is. I also am unintentionally using it on Mean Girls Week because October 3rd. Um, so, that is fun because I just feel like the pinks are very Mean Girls. Um, but yeah, the colors in this are super cute. I just, that one is just so good. Um, it's like not something I ever wear, but I think it's really fun to put in my planner. <laughs> so for the bottom washi, it is quite a bit darker, but I did get this Pixel 15 milliliter to go along with it. I thought that was super fun. And then some Carly Plans boarding passes I brought in because this is actually the week I am going to meet Carly. So I have more of these coming because I don't have one for um, like the airport in New York. And then for foil, I've got this Kristen's Planner foil bundle in Silver Pixie. So I got the spoopy underlays. They are so shiny. I debated doing something under this because the kit is so fun. I was like, maybe I could do pink, but honestly, these are so chunky that like, I don't want to put anything under them. So yeah, <laughs> I'll just let it shine on its own. For September 9th through the 15th, I'm using this Leonard Designs Haunted Halloween kit, and I do PR for Leonard Designs, so if you use Laurel 15, you'll get my freebie and a discount and Laurel in the notes during sales. So for this kit, I love the blue touches in it. I thought those were really pretty, so um, that influenced my foil choice. I got this big box. I know I keep saying I'm going to try to use these, um, and last time I tried, I messed it up, but I'm going to try again. <laughs> um, and then I have to use the witch in this kit. So this is the week that the Taylor Swift era's movie is coming to theaters, and I'm seeing it twice that weekend. So... Because of that, I was like, well, maybe I should switch my kit, but I feel like the like black, gray, red really f gives me like reputation. And then, I mean, with some of the foil I have, it's kind of a lighter blue, so um, that kind of fits 1989, and then obviously red for red, so I'm just stretching and saying that the colors work because I love this kit and I still want to use it this week so um and I also ordered like custom quotes and stuff in the the foil for this for the foil I have these um in red glitter from these overlays from Leonard Designs uh they're spoopy one this one's 068 and that's oh that's also 068 maybe they're on the same listing but yeah I got the um, tall box in the large box and then I did get a spooky foil bundle I'm not sure if I said spooky before um, and this is in teal so I just thought this would be pretty for the blue aspect but then that kind of like I'm like well it's teal ish for Taylor Swift 1989 I don't know I'm just silly but it's all right. Then to mix with it, I do have this 15 millimeter from Kristen's Planner in sparkly red. Um, I've got like an old uh, movie list from Planet Hannah, so it's partly used in sparkly red, as well as this Horror One uh, box overlay set. And then I do have these Kristen's Planner sparkly red solids to go under the foil that came in the foil bundle which I just think is going to be so cute together so excited for the week of 
October 16th through the 22nd. I am using the Spooky Babe kit from Linder's Designs. So I was gonna use a different kit this week and then I had to kind of move it around because um, when this art came out, I was like, well, crap, I need it. So <laughs> yeah, um, it's got ghost face elements like in there and the keychain on the first page, but also I just really think it's cool. It's like traditional Halloween colors. So yeah, I don't really see that super often. So I wanted to use it. And I mean, I'm here for all the fun different like color combos for Halloween. I just thought this was different than like a lot of what I've seen this year. And then I've got a movie bucket list from Carly Plans, which I did forget to mention I do PR for Carly Plans. So if you use Laurel 15, you'll get a discount on my freebie and Laurel in the notes during any sale. This movie bucket list is the anytime spooky movie bucket list. Uh, some of the fonts are gonna look different on the new one, but I'm watching Rocky Horror this week because it's the, um, would have been the birthday for my sister's first husband, Chris. So, uh, then for the foil, I am using orange glitter and chicker treat from Leonard Designs. I just thought this went perfectly. Um, I didn't overthink it. I might be using black solids with this, but I haven't decided yet. Next for the week of October 23rd through the 29th, I'm using groovy goals from Crest Press. I mean, y'all know I was going to, or knew I was going to use it. So, um... I'm failing to remember who said it. I think I might have been Planners and Magic um, that if you squint, the bats look like seagulls uh, for Taylor Swift 1989, which is coming out this week. That's why I picked this kit for this week, but I had to use it. Also, this kind of looks like from her music video for Antihero, which is obviously not the same album. Well, I guess not obviously, but yeah, it's still Taylor Swift related. So um, I'm obsessed with this art. Like I, I love it. I had already ordered it when um, she said that on Instagram, but then I was like, perfect. I know exactly which week to use it. So <laughs> yeah, these colors are just so fun. The patterns as well. So then um, I love the groovy checker thing, but I'm going to use the date covers and then I am using these two for my bottom washi. And all oh, that's cute. It's a little advent. Then for foil, um, I don't have everything, but I am using a combination of um, sea foam or like blue hollow, depending on the shop it's from. Uh, light purple hollow, orange hollow, and pink hollow. So this is an orange hollow from Kristen's Planner. It was a foil of the month. Just some spooky scripts. And then uh, this is the lyric from 1989 that I will be using. I've got uh, the floral ghosts from Plant With Me stickers. Um, and this is in blue hollow as well as that last one I showed. And then I got the G-Face underlays from Linder Designs. This is in light purple hollow, sea foam hollow, orange hollow, pink hollow. And then I couldn't decide which underlays to use or I might mix it up. I don't know what I'm doing for sure. Um, so I got the checkered spider web underlays as well from Plan With Me stickers in pink hollow, purple hollow, and blue hollow. And then orange hollow, I couldn't get, but uh, Domi is going to send me one. So then this is also purple hollow, and I might use black under them. Again, I, I got to make decisions. For October 30th through November 5th, so the week of actual Halloween, I am using Trick or Treat from Leonard Science. So I did get the purple to replace the yellow for a 15 millimeter. And this is just super fun, trick or treat vibes. Uh, it gives me a lot of nostalgia, but it's also really perfect if you do have kids to use. Uh, so I thought it was fun to use the week of Halloween. We definitely used to carve jack-o'-lanterns. Um, and I just love these colors. I think they're really cool. 
cool. I don't know. I, they, they look good together. I don't know what I'm trying to say. So I did get the icon doodles. And then I got a foil pack from Leonard Designs in Midnight Purple. This is Trick or Treat. And um, I just thought this went well. Love the color. And then I... I'm also using uh, sea foam from Kristen's Planner, so I got a, an extra 15 millimeter to pull in, and then solids. For my filming planner this month, I am using a spooky movie theme. September was just movies, and then October is spooky movies. So this is a really old Scribble Friends Co. kit. It's called Ghost with the Most. It is obviously Beetlejuice themed. And um, this was like a really old freebie. So the glitter has these stripes, which is a really fun touch. Um, and then so do the glitter headers. So I'm just obsessed with that aspect of it. I think this is a mini, yeah, it's a mini kit because I used to get those and yeah, so this is gonna be interesting to use, but I did get two of the label add-ons at least. So that does help some. Uh, but yeah, the littles are just always a challenge. And then I've got the 15 millimeter add-on and the washi and date covers. And then for foil with this, I am using a combination of Kiwi from Kristen's Planner as well as Solid Black from her. So for the 15 millimeter, I've got this like, it's like gingham, but it's checkered enough pattern and then I've got solids to put under this that I got so I mean it's, it's shiny black you can kind of tell it shines um, but the stripes with the green under it I thought would just be really cool and this is her old format too so it looks different oh, I forgot to say the underlay is called stripe though for the second through the eighth, I am using the Mean Girls kit from SPC. Um, I know this isn't like spooky per se, but it is an October movie to me and I've held off on using it because I have so many Halloween kits all the time, but I want to just go use it. That just would be fun. Also Carly from Carly Plans happens to be using this kit the same week as me, so um, that was just a happy coincidence. Oh, this is really cute. I feel like you could use it for like Christmas time or you could use it for Valentine's. The color palette's really like Valentine's-y to me. Uh, then from Once More With Love, I've got the Mean Girls doodles and the rest of them I did just pull off on reusable sticker paper a while back. So I'll just be using those with it. And then I got purple tie-dye from Planet Hannah. This is a really old foil bundle because I got it when the kit came out. So everything's like all separate. Um, and then I did get the heart three for the 15 millimeter and doodles for the underlays, the line overlays. And then I got the Regina overlays to go with it. For the ninth through the 15th, I'm using this You'll Float 2 kit from Kristen's Planner. She does not make kits anymore, but I got this back when she did have some kits in shop and I mean, it's just really fun. I, I really like the It movies, so I'm excited to finally use this. This was another one that I just didn't have room for last year. So there's tons of little things, which is really nice. Um, I guess these are like bit bigger little things, but yeah, I'm happy about that. Uh, this was, I think it, either an add-on or a freebie, I don't know. And then I've just got like Friday the 13th custom scripts. For foil, I am using primarily red. So I've got these header overlays from Chasing Chels. Date numbers from Planet Hannah. This is a shop that's not open anymore. Um, more just like random stuff from Planet Hannah. I've got these wonton and a million characters. Uh, some icons. Uh, these are like, I think these are dividers, or I used to put them on boxes sometimes, like with these two. 
Um, so I don't know if I'll use those, but I pulled them in anyway. And then for bottom washi, I've got this like bow and heart from Kristen's planner. It's 009 and 002, but she's done a lot of stuff with her washi. So I don't know if that's necessarily going to be in shop the same. Then for underlays, I've got the lover ones. These were also offered at Kristen's planner when she had the kit. I've got these scripts from Planna Hannah and then some solid underlays to go under those lover ones because I think that'll really pop. For the 16th through the 22nd, I have this Leonard Designs Rocky Horror Kit. This is another old Leonard Designs kit, but again, I didn't get to use this when it came out, so I've just been hanging on to it. I am also using it this week specifically because October 19th was um, my sister's late husband's birthday. So um, he showed me this movie and he also used to quote it. <laughs> so I just thought it would be fun to use this week. And I know it's not like a spooky exactly, but I mean, it's, I feel like everyone watches it around Halloween time. So I've got these customs for birthdays from Leonard Designs and I've got that spooky movie bucket list again from Carly Plans, which now you see why I'm watching the movie this week. And then I've got a mixture of gold and sparkly red foil. So um, Dottie from Kristen's Planner, some date numbers. I've got a couple of these SPC labels, uh, date numbers from Planet Hannah, as well as scripts. I got the gold 002 15 millimeter from Christian's Planner. Bows from SPC from an old like Wiggle Wednesday. And then I did get some custom quotes. So you won't really probably get any of these except maybe I just lost the game. <laughs> but these are just things that um are related to him that remind me of him so I'm using those this week and then um his name is Chris I don't know why I didn't mention that <laughs> I know it's not Harry Potter but the lightning bolts in the kit I thought worked well with that and then I've got Tara's freebie from Christian's planner and some gold solids for the 23rd through the 29th, I'm using this Tricks and Treats kit from Paper Candy Art, which is themed after the movie Trick or Treat, if you haven't seen it. So this was one of the few shops that I actually saw that had the art. Um, some of the boxes are not my favorite, but there's so many between the add-ons that I got and the ones that came in the kit that I am gonna love all the ones that I use. This is so cute with Sam. I love that double box spread. I think, um, well, I know I'm going to use it, but I just think it's adorable. So the colors in this are kind of like wild. So my foil is too. <laughs> because of course. Um, so yeah, her format's a little bit different. Some of the stuff I won't use, but it definitely comes with plenty. Yeah, like she has really huge kits. <laughs> so then for my foil, I've got these header overlays and orange glitter from Kristen's Planner. I've got deep purple 093 15 millimeter. Green glitter spooky things underlays as well as orange glitter. A deep purple solids to go under those. Oops. And then I've just got a, basically a whole mixture of those colors of foil from different shops. I'll pull in some of it. Some of it will go back to my storage, but um, I just wanted to have all the options. So this is actually a hollow in it too, but it's like a dark purple hollow mix. I still don't understand how people can double foil stuff like that like I don't know how that process works I can't comprehend it but it's really cool I guess I folded these because yeah <laughs> probably to fit in my storage so yeah I've just got like a ton of stuff and this is like a green laser but it's it is similar to the glitter 
yeah. <laughs> so that's all the foil for that. Last but definitely not least, for the 30th through November 5th, I am using the Scaredy Cat kit from Leonard Designs, which is scream themed so i had to i am going to do everything i can to use this big box because it goes really well with the like overlay she made which i'll show in a minute so i got the uh, character add-on because i'm going to use that one i think it looks you know like drew barrymore that's why i got blonde i've got these in case i need some extras to use all the other boxes i want icon doodles um and then that i guess you can't see it this scene there is a small and a big version of so if I mess up the big box I can still use that uh, scene with it so yeah I'm just really excited so for foil I did get the G face foil pack from Leonard designs in strawberry which is like a pinky red and then this it's over this it just it looks so good so I'm gonna have to do that <laughs> somehow I love this whole thing um I talked about it in my haul but I was like picking out individual things and then I was like no it's just perfect so I'm gonna stop like trying to pick individual things out of the foil pack thank you so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in the next one bye